Yeah! All right, so last night I went and got Logan on Blu-ray. It was uh, 20 bucks. It was worth every cent that I paid for it. Um, you know, we got the DVD, we got in Blu-ray and special features, and we also got it in black and white. Yes, we got it in Noor. Here's what I thought. Right, so basically the premise of the film is that Wolverine and Professor X uh, Wolverine finds out that he has a daughter, and so basically him and Professor X are just trying to get away from these bad guys and their leader. Who is played by Boyd Holbrook, and I thought that he did an amazing job in this movie, though. Logan felt like a fun thrill ride with intense measurements that will keep being thrown at you to the very end. Okay, I swear to God, Logan did one thing that all the other Wolverine movies couldn't do. It made me laugh. And the funny thing is, is that this movie isn't as interpreted as a comedic film like all the other ones. This one's actually more serious, but it still somehow made you laugh. It felt like the closest that I had been to the characters throughout all the X-Men films. In a way, Logan also felt like a western, neo-western film, you know, but not because it took place in southern areas, but it was kind of like the journey that they were on. And yes, I cried because this is the last two hours of a Wolverine film that Marvel and 20th Century Fox will give us. And I was really thankful that the little kid in this movie wasn't one of those annoying ass kids. Uh, you know, she, she was adorable, you know? And Hugh Jackman and her had the cutest father and daughter relationship that I had seen in a while. Do I think that it was time for them to close the curtain? Mm, yeah, a little bit, you know? I mean, it finally completed the trilogy. And, you know, I feel that they they just need a time to shut down, you know? I mean, they gave us X-Men Origins, they gave us the Wolverine, and now they gave us Logan. You know, some part of me doesn't want to let go of this, but another part of me tells me that I think it's time to move on. You know, we got an upcoming Gambit movie, New Mutants on the way, and, you know, I just, I'm really excited for all that to happen. And a lot of people thought that, you know, Hugh Jackman was really tired of playing Wolverine, you know, on the part side, that might be kind of true, but he still has respect for Wolverine, though. Alright, thank you, Hugh Jackman, for making these X-Men years great. Uh, my name is The Italian Jedi, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.